Good day! In this short video, we will have a look at what the effect of a transaction on the accounting equation will be when a business earns income. All businesses aim to earn income and in the end to make a profit. Examples of income that a business can earn is through the sale of inventory, fees earned for services rendered, interest income and many more. An income account increases on the credit side and decreases on the debit side. Income also has the effect on equity, that it increases equity on the credit side and decreases equity on the debit side. As a general rule, all income earned will be recorded on the credit side because it increases. Every once in a while, you might have a correction to income because something was recorded incorrectly, for example, and then you will debit the income account and it will decrease. Let's look at an example. ABC Architects is not a registered VAT vendor and has a favorable bank balance of 50,000 Rand. ABC Architects earned fees for services rendered to the amount of 5,000 Rand. The amount was deposited directly into the business bank account. In this case, the business earned fees and therefore income will increase equity with 5,000 Rand. The income account fees earned or services rendered will be credited. On the other hand, the bank account, which is an asset, increased with the money that was deposited into the bank account and therefore we will see an increase of 5,000 Rand under assets. The bank account will be debited with the 5,000 Rand. If we now slightly change the example to state that ABC Architects had an unfavorable bank balance, then the solution will slightly change. Instead of assets increasing, we will now see a decrease on liabilities. The reason for this is a bank overdraft is classified as a liability. A liability account decreases on the debit side. So your bank account will still be debited with the income of 5,000 Rand, the money that you received, but it will now decrease the amount that you owe to the bank and therefore the accounting equation will reflect a minus 5,000 Rand under liabilities. The fees for services rendered will still increase equity with a plus 5,000 Rand since the income account will be credited. If we once again change the example slightly, this time to state an invoice was issued but no payments have been received. This means that ABC Architects delivered the services and invoiced the client, but the client has not yet paid. This means the client still owes money to ABC Architects. This means that we will now debit the asset account named Trade and Other Receivables Control. The Money owed by the client increases the asset account because we will in future collect the money from the client. Assets on the accounting equation will therefore increase with a plus 5,000 Rand. The fees for services rendered or the income account will still be credited and it will still increase equity with a plus 5,000 Rand on the accounting equation. After watching this short video, you should now be able to record a transaction where a business earns income and the money is deposited into a bank account with a favorable bank balance, as well as when it's deposited into a bank account with an unfavorable bank balance and when the income was earned on credit on the accounting equation. Thank you for watching.